Oh, boy. You know, this whole thing happening with Elon Musk and Twitter reminds me of, I think it was Mike Tyson who had that line where he said, uh, everybody has a plan until they get punched in the face. <laughs> because now it feels like Elon Musk is just like scrambling, making it up as he goes along, which I get, which I get. You've spent $44 billion for a company that most people say shouldn't be more than worth like 20 something billion. You're, you're gonna scramble, you know? And he's, tr he's trying everything. What's amazing to me is like what's happening with Elon Musk is a wonderful microcosm to show you how much or how quickly people will abandon what they say is a principle when things aren't going their way, you know? So one of the first things Elon said when, when he took over was like, comedy is now legal on Twitter. And he was like, it's time for free speech, time for comedy, time for people to actually have fun on Twitter again. <laughs> and then what people started doing was they started changing their names to Elon Musk, <laughs> right? So people changed their Twitter handles to Elon Musk. And then they just started tweeting things as if they were Elon Musk. They were like, I'm such a terrible person, my wife left me. Um, <laughs> just random, random shit, right? And then Twitter just banned all of their accounts. They're like, suspended, suspended, suspended. And then he was like, you no know parodying of people on the, he's like, unless you say it's a parody, it's like, it's like, what? So it's not funny now? It's not, <laughs> it's not funny. And this is the thing, you, you, you know, that people never seem to understand, is everybody who is pro-free speech is not pro all speech. What they are pro is the speech that they wish to use that might hurt to offend other people. And then, and then when some, cause you're like, what's, what's wrong, Elon? When people are just messing around with their handles, like, no, they're, they're impersonating me. And it's like, well, why is that a bad thing? Because this, this could cause harm and panic. Oh, it could cause harm and panic. So you're saying somebody just saying something could cause harm? Well, not in the way you're saying it. I was like, yeah, man, everyone thinks jokes are funny until the joke is about them. That's the thing I've learned, right? And now he's there and all of it. He's like, oh, the company, we're gonna do it. Like, we don't care. He's like, this, that's why I'm buying it because then you don't have to worry about the advertisers. We're gonna do this thing. And then the advertisers are like, all right, well, we're leaving. Wait, <laughs> wait, oh, I do care about the advertisers. <laughs> oh, man. And then it's funny how, like, it's funny how he doesn't, like, even, even his logic becomes illogical based on his own logic. So he goes, we're gonna do verified for everybody, you just have to pay $8, right? Which undermines the purpose of verification. Now, I'm not for or against, I think, to be honest with you, I would love it, I would love to live in a world where everyone on Twitter was verified. I'd like to know that we're talking to humans as opposed to a bot or anything else. So I, I don't mind if everyone is verified. But what's funny is Elon going like, no, I'm making this for the people. And so if the people pay $8, you all get to be verified. And it's like, wait, so if people pay, they're verified? Yeah. And then someone was like, well, what if, what if, then how will you know if this is now a government institution and how, because someone could just start an account of someone who doesn't even have an account, then they could verify it now Technically, there's no other account that they're parodying, so are they the account? And then when people go on, they're like, it is the account, it's verified. Do they act on that information? And then like the team at Twitter and Elon were like, no, under the verification will be some sort of verification to say that they are. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, so, so now there's gonna be double verification. <laughs> what happened to power to the people? Now you're gonna be like, I'm double verified versus you're one verified. And it's like, oh, oh all right, $16? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man.